only at the Indianapolis Zoo. Hey guys, Will here. I'm a desert's keeper at the Indianapolis Zoo. We're here with our mob of four meerkats. We've got Cato, Cashmere, Katniss, and Prim. Um, you'll see here they're eating on some mealworms. Uh, we do spread it out for them. Meerkats will actually spend five to eight hours foraging for food. So instead of just tossing them right in front of them, we like to spread them around and give them some activity to go through. Um, you can probably see they've got really long, sharp claws. They're very good at digging, at foraging, digging up all kinds of uh, bugs. In the wild, they eat lots of beetles and all kinds of other insects, including scorpions. At the Indianapolis Zoo, we'll feed them uh, mealworms, soupworms, crickets, and roaches primarily. They also get some fruits and vegetables to round out their diet. So a group of meerkats is called a mob, and they can range anywhere from two to around 30 individuals. Here we've got our nice small group of four. They're very social animals, so they live together. You'll see that there's usually a sentry out. If you come visit at the, at the Indianapolis Zoo, you'll see one of them probably propped up on our termite mound looking around. Um, that's the sentry, and there's usually always one looking out for predators. They're looking out up in the sky for hawks and eagles and down on the ground for things like jackals or foxes. And if they notice any predators coming near, they'll cry out. And, and once the rest of the mob hears that call, they all run for the burrows to hide from the predator until uh, it's safe and sound again. Thanks so much for visiting us online, guys. We hope to see you at the Indianapolis Zoo again soon. Thank you.